Peace, love, and light. This message is for Scorpio. Scorpios, I hope the sun is shining wherever you are and you're living in your greatest purpose. Thank you, Scorpios, for your likes, comment, shares, and subscribes. We are on our way to 10K. Manifesting that thing. Um, <laughs> um, if any of the messages resonate with you, um, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Let's get into your messages. All right. <laughs> it took a minute to think about what I was going to say, uh, Scorpios, because you know how I like you usually have one way of doing something and you change it. And so what that does is you have to think differently. Yeah, when you change, when you change your routine, like if you notice, leave a comment down below if you find this is the case for you. Usually when you get into a routine of things, it's almost like it's almost like the routines take no thought, right? And then as soon as you break routine, right? And it's like you start doing something different. It also takes you thinking differently. So sometimes what that may end up doing is not only are you thinking differently, you're speaking differently as well. Which, um, you know, change is always, always, it's, it's always a positive thing. Even though it doesn't seem like it um, at first. Okay, let's see what messages are showing up for you. Messages for Scorpio Spirit. Mm. Okay, I'm seeing actually saw the ace of swords pop up and just now right after the ace of swords popped up um i saw the word clarity like you know specifically i saw the word crystal clear so i wonder what your guys are trying to tell you messages for scorpio spirit okay we got three of wands Four of Pentacles and Ten of Wands. Okay. Um, immediately, what I'm seeing is the positive. Okay. The energy of the positive is showing up. Let's see if we can adjust this. Okay. The energy of the positive is showing up. The moving forward. Uh, and specifically, this is an energy of like being able to see what's ahead. Hmm. The three of wands is showing you what's ahead. So perhaps your guides are trying to give you an idea of, um, of what is ahead, what to look forward to. Okay. Seven of cups showing up. Seven of Cups. Okay, so let's let's look at this. Mm, uh, I'm seeing there's a possibility of like whatever is ahead may have to do with you dealing with something that is currently happening. Something that is current in your energy. Your guys could be telling you to deal with something. There's the number four again. Four, four could be significant. So some aspect of your stability could be um, at the forefront of whatever message your guides have for you. Okay, let's see. Show me three of wands. Look how that showed up. <laughs> Conflict. Ah, okay, so it's interesting because I'm seeing to take it like this. There could be something that is mm, something that's presenting itself as a challenge. You may or may not see this at the time, at this time. Something that's in that's in opposition to possibly what you are trying to do. There's that number five again. Hmm. Yeah, 
Yep, and I'm seeing this has to do with your stability. Something, something may need to be dealt with. Something may need to be addressed regarding your stability in order for you to move ahead. Your guides are... Mm, this is like the attention, you know... Something is being brought to your attention regarding your stability. Or, or your guides are saying there's something regarding your stability uh, that's impacting something having to do with you moving forward. I'm seeing the words clashing. There could be something clashing, energies clashing. You, you may or may not feel like there's energies clashing or there's some kind of like... Uh, there's some kind of thing. It may be some egos here. Take it as it resonates. It may not be the same thing for everyone. This is definitely something having to do with your stability. Your guys could be telling you, uh, you may come across someone. This may be kind of like a heads up for this kind of energy. Your guys have been giving you heads up quite a bit. Um... Okay, someone someone may be meditating something on something or may need to meditate on something. Uh, okay, I'm seeing the word words word. Okay, there may be something that could potentially cause an argument. Um Hmm, something that may actually throw off like the balance and harmony, possibly even within your home or within something having to do with your stability. Hmm. I'm seeing a lot of fire energy here, so that may be significant for some of you. It's something or someone that's showing up as a possible op opposition someone that possibly like there's an energy like it's a clash uh, something clashing something's not in agreement like the balance could be thrown off your guys could be telling you to watch out for that some of you i'm seeing uh an energy of you having thought about this uh this may not even be the first time you've this has come across your radar whatever it is that your guides are giving you a heads up on okay let's uh tell me about this five of wands hmm. a family situation there's, there's, for some of you, there could be some challenges within your family. Something that you may or may not be aware of. I'm seeing unhappy family. There's a lot of family energy here. Some, some, someone perhaps. Someone. Someone's unhappy. Hmm. It's a lot of fours. This is having to do with your stability, someone's stability, or like a stable home environment. So it's, it, it could be that someone's stable. Something about someone's home environment, possibly. Tell me about this ten of cups. Hmm. It almost didn't want to fall, and it went over. <laughs> Let's get that flying card. Okay, here it is. Oh, it's a lot of thinking here. Someone's been doing a lot of thinking. Someone could be, this may be you or someone in your family could be thinking about like family circumstances or there could be just a lot of thoughts. I keep seeing the number four. Look at that. Someone's, 
there there are some challenges regarding a home situation that's in question here and someone could be thinking about this a lot someone someone that may have had something to do with this energy of five of wands that's showing up there's the four of pentacles again it's some past issues possibly with family um hmm. Someone may have actually, someone, someone's health may have actually taken a turn regarding something that's been heavily weighing on their mind. Something heavy, okay? It's a, it's, it's a, it's a, it's a situation that's weighing heavily on someone's mind, possibly having to do with a family, maybe your family or a family situation someone's been thinking about this a lot and i'm even seeing there's a possibility that uh someone's health may be suffering or someone's health could have been impacted by something um having to do with this family and it it, it seems like it seems like this person had something to do with whatever situation is plaguing this person it seems like it it seems like it's their own ego that's now plaguing them for something that they did having to do with a family situation okay and i'm seeing different things here i'm seeing cheating i'm seeing uh possible like possibly someone who has some kind of like a material uh like a fixation of some sort like you know they may have like had their eyes on something um I'm even seeing greed it's possible this person's greed um something's happening here something's happening and it may actually be this person's own like subconscious their own um mind weighing in on something that they did having to do i'm seeing the words mental overload this person's this person's having some sort of a breakdown possibly breakdown meltdown um like mental there's some kind of like mental thing that's happening with this person uh, as a result of something who goodness gracious okay tell me more about this four of pentacles it's appearing twice and i'm seeing in this case see that something in secret oh whatever it is that they were holding on to they kept it secret they they weren't telling they weren't telling someone they weren't telling people um it was something that they kept for themselves something that's actually it's coming to light this full moon is coming is bringing a lot of things to light yeah it's bringing a lot of things to light and one of the things that's happening with this person this person is basically like with this eight of swords situation this person has basically sent themselves into their own like mental prison that's what it seems like because like literally this person is mm, it's like they want release they want release they want they want to be free from something they want to be free from something and it's something that's like that's got them bound to something you may be dealing with a fire sign leo sag aries some of you could be dealing with a female fire sign someone possibly that's in your own family this if this is not your own family it's a family that has some ties to you that's going through something going through um energetically there's something happening with this person There's something happening energetically with this person. And the Six of Cups. Mm, okay, now. Okay. 
tell me about this ten of wands karma karma is weighing heavily on this person see that look at that ten ten yep karma is weighing heavily on this person dang yeah this it's like some some something about their like it could it if it, it's like it's almost like you know it, it's so much like it's so much heaviness tied th to this energy um and i'm seeing something specific uh something could be significant about this uh, horns i'm seeing horns like possibly even a taurus some some someone who could be a taurus or yeah something significant about the, the horns and and perhaps uh, a tie to someone who kind of sense a, a feel or feel a sense of okay now Mm, yeah like their energy is strong they can't talk it's hard for them to speak this that's that's one of the things that's going on with this person it's like it's like things are turning upside down in and out or inside out like things are not making sense it may actually be someone also tied or linked to this person in this energy someone who's a possible tourist because i'm seeing like uh, major attention being placed on like the horns it's like a bull or like like a like Taurus I'm getting a strong Taurus energy um yep possible earth sign showing up here a king of pentacles um possibility of them being involved in look just as we uh you know we said something about a Taurus there they are so there could be a Taurus involved in this as well A king of pentacles uh and this king of pentacles i'm seeing like the full card appearing first could be that they feel a sense of like <clears throat> they they may feel a sense of naive or <clears throat> it's almost like yeah like the throat chakra stuff like this person's they may be feeling at this time like they don't know what to say as it relates to something that's happening here there's a family situation that's tied to something of a uh, to some past having to do with someone who did some kind of like deceitful thing and they could have also involved someone else in this and whoever it is that they involved in this or they were involved together like someone's someone's kind of like feeling the blow a lot more than someone else and i'm seeing that this person right here <clears throat> this taurus energy really really strong this person feels like a fool they feel foolish anything else you want to tell us oh here it is it went over again <clears throat> Okay, and look at what's showing up. Mm. Some top, someone's tower is crumbling. Something's going down. Something's going down, and and the energies that showed up, partnership. They could have partnered with one another. You may have two people that are showing up. See, there's something about this energy that has to do with you moving forward. Like at the beginning of this reading, your guides are telling you like, it's almost like until something happens or as something happens, this is when you're going to know it's time for you to move forward or your things are moving forward. And there's something that your guides are saying that something's going to come to light regarding um some family secrets possibly that's tied to something happening for you okay something see that it could have to do with a betrayal um someone also may feel a sense of like um mm. 
it's a sense of remorse is what i'm seeing i'm seeing the word remorse like someone 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 feels bad for what they did and and i'm seeing that all of that is the wheels of karma working the wheels of karma are working in your favor and and for whatever reason what that's doing it's like it, it, it's almost like it it trips some sort of like a switch where it's like like things are unfolding and not just like unfolding it's also causing someone to go through some sort of like it's appearing as like it's some kind of energy that's like similar to some sort of like a mental breakdown um it's and it almost seems like it's an energy of like confession of, or something like that Look at that, karmic retribution. Someone's taking accountability. Or perhaps they didn't before. And it's weighing on them now. Look at that, like that sense of remorse, it's showing up here. There's that five energy again. Okay, anything else you wanna tell us? Ooh, there you are, this is about you. This is about, listen, your guys are saying you walked away right on time, right in time. It's some ish that's about to go down in some kind of dyna dynamic that you don't want to be there for. Okay? You walked away right in time. It's something happened. Something's happening. Something's unfolding. And your guides, I'm specifically hearing, they're saying you better be thankful that you're not there to witness this because the kind of stuff that's going down, you don't want to be there for it. It's like it's like folks teaming up to do stuff. Truth, King of Swords, the truth is being revealed to you. Yep. <clears throat> It's some stuff. It's some stuff. Now, this ancestor card that just showed up is like mm, it's saying it's saying to, to pick up this deck. What do you have? What message do you have? <laughs> Look at that, the moon card. The moon card is appearing. <clears throat> 26, 18, and 16. See? The tower card. It's this this right here, it's showing like some some revelation, secrets being revealed. And I'm seeing what this is. This is this is an energy of protection that's showing up for you. Your guys are telling you that you're protected against all this. It's some stuff. It's some stuff. And it's like that energy that I was seeing, like something's going to happen that's going to make way for something else. This may just be that. It's like some revelations that are taking place. And, and it's it's like your God's telling you, like, this is one of the steps that had to take place before you officially, like, some of, some of you, I'm seeing, like, there's some energetic ties to some, some group, possibly, like, family-like group okay that's like mm, it's some it's some stuff involved that you're not there for and your guides are saying you better be thankful that you're not um so it says if you have a yes or no question pop a fire steps forward as clear yes the time is now for that big passionate vision all things are possible you are possible keep the enthusiasm up your qualities as a natural born leader are required get it done as usual you're trying to wear all hats but that will stagnate your growth oh, you need support in your current endeavor mm. it's like i'm seeing that your gods are saying like you are being led to deal with something and it's like as you deal with something you're also going to be able to move forward okay it's like you have 
things to look forward to um or your guys are saying this is what you get to look forward to okay it says you are possible keep the enthusiasm up your qualities as a natural born leader are required get it done okay and for whatever reason there was an emphasis on that let's go back to 18 now uh hmm this is a warning. Your guides are saying, watch your back. Caution, danger up ahead. This is a time of illusions. If they tell you the sky is blue, check. Dishonesty, deception, and uncertainty are in the air. Trust your intuition. Your inner voice is screaming to get your attention. There's more to this situation than meets the eye. Yep. There's more to the situation than meets the eye. It says here, you're in for a roller coaster ride. Emotional distress is no joke. The dark night of the soul is upon you. Your subconscious fears and limiting beliefs are showing out. Be aware of how you project fear in relationships, conversations, and negotiations. The things you stuff down in your subconscious are refusing to be suppressed. I'm seeing this. This has a lot to do with this person that, that suppress this stuff some sort of stuff in the past they suppress that's now coming out it's it's like it's like your guides your spirit guides are making them deal with their shadow selves what yep they're they're dealing with it they're dealing with it okay so now i'm seeing this one chaos and destruction this is 16 okay this right here is equivalent to the tower. Check this out. Upheaval. Your life is on fire right now. It is about to burn down. But the great news is that the sun will rise tomorrow. How are you going to handle it? This is the magical question. So someone's life right now is very interesting. It's like your guides are speaking to whoever it is that's showing up in this energy of like, you know. It's like they're perturbed this energy right here okay um and it's almost like this person that you know what whoever it is that could be going through this it's like they cause their own situation they could also be looking for some kind of like comfort it's like things are beginning to be revealed everything is coming out this right here this is equivalent to uh, the moon card, like whatever secrets there was, it's being, um, ex it's being exposed. It's being shown. It's, it's coming into light. It's being revealed. And it's like someone is literally being forced to deal. This is exactly how I'm hearing this. They're being forced to deal with their demons. Yep. And I'm seeing it's like, in terms of like what you have to look forward to i'm seeing it's like you're 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 either gonna receive signs or this is your sign that it's like things are also about to change for you because it's like like whatever tower moment they're having those are those are also signs you're going to receive signs okay some of you you may have already received signs of like someone who is doing something behind the scenes you're go like and specifically i'm seeing it's against you okay some of you are going to receive signs that things are happening regarding the people that were doing things against you and they're working in your favor and this is this is also a sign for you that it's like like the wheels are like turning in your favor and it's you're gonna see the signs and it, and it's gonna be like a sign that you know things are about to really pick up and move forward from this point on that is the message if this message resonates please like comment share and subscribe until next time love peace and divine light